being a creative on Tumblr culture is going through all the 24 reblogs on your post with 357 notes just to get enough serotonin to get through your day by reading what the five God sent people who left tags wrote. I mean, yeah. They have learned rather quickly that I provide breakfast on a regular schedule. Was five minutes late and got told for it. Yo, tell your slippers they need to calm down. You know how, like, some artists and stuff will draw tears as, like, really big droplets and stuff? I want that. I'm tired of crying in these tiny, stupid tears. I want large tears that are, like, the size of my fingernails. That's the good stuff. Big teary goth girlfriend. Friendly reminder that Ed ate an entire slide because there was a pebble in his shoe. Well, what else are you supposed to do? From here on out, to avoid confusion, I'm going to end any joking statement I write on Tumblr.com with a large high-res photograph of a clown to indicate that it's written in jest. You, you're joking, right? Do you see a clown? Okay, current John Mulaney is great, but seeing pictures from his childhood is just so adorable. POV, your Princess Diana. For a split second, I thought this was the once there. Don't you ever compare John Mulaney to the once there again. I know some naughty words that really knock your socks off. But I'm not wearing socks. Well, then I know some caring words that'll put socks on you. <gasps> Tradition is just peer pressure from dead people. I want this on a bumper sticker. Pregnancy is a hoax. The baby sprouts out of the ground. I've seen it happen. People pretend to be pregnant for clout. It started with one woman named DVD, and people have been chasing the same high since. I'm sorry, I meant Eve. I got tiny little hands, but they're beautiful. Adrian Shine, the leader of the Loch Ness Project, looks exactly like how I imagined the leader of the Loch Ness Project looked like. What a masterpiece of a photo. He looks like he knows everything. Sitting here having to rub feet on a calf to get a nervous mom to lick it and bond with it, the human equivalent would be rubbing some good food on a baby so a mom loves it. The doctor hands me a newborn son and I decide I don't like him, actually. So he just hits him with a pie like clowns do. My favorite thing about the contrast between early Christianity and ancient Greek and Roman religion is that the difference in the ways they think and talk about their gods is really similar to the difference between how dog and cat owners talk about their pets. Early Christians are like, This is our god, he's omnipotent and omniscient, and he's better than all of the other gods. The Greeks are like, this is our party god Dionysus. He got into an argument with a bunch of frogs once and we love him. Fuck silverfish. If those are the little bug things that look like centipedes, then yeah, fuck them. Oh my fucking god. I hate them so much. Oh, in Minecraft, I thought you were talking about like real ones. Wait, what do you mean real ones? Where do you think the name came from? Oh, I don't know, Tumblr user Plump9000. I sort of thought they weren't real, like Endermen or Creepers! Implying Endermen aren't real. Really not liking what you're implying, buddy!